So for this problem, to write the standard equation and the general equation of the parabola with given focus and equation of direct tracks. So first, we need to graph this given and for the graph, opens upward. So this is the formula for the standard equation. Opens downward, the formula for the standard equation opens to the right and opens to the left. So these are the different formulas for the standard equation. So from this given for focus, so this is x and y. So x is negative 2 and y is negative 5. Then you connect and this is now the point of the focus then for this equation of direct tracks x equals positive 6 so this is x positive 6 so we have now the equation of the direct tracks so the broken line then this time we need to find the vertex and in the parabola vertex is in the center between focus and direct tracks. So to find the center between focus and direct tracks, we need to find first the distance from focus to direct tracks. So we're going to use the counting method. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, then to find the center, divide by 2, so 8 divided by 2, that's 4, then we need to count 4 to locate the vertex, so we have 1, 2, 3, 4, so this is now the point of the vertex at x equals positive 2. Then take note that focus must be aligned to the vertex. So this is the vertex. So we have the vertex and the vertex. So these two points must be aligned. So on this graph, to locate now the vertex, since this is the focus, so we need to align for the vertex. So this is now the point of the vertex aligned to this focus. Then to graph now this parabola, since focus always inside the parabola, and this is the focus, so therefore this parabola opens to the left, so focus inside the parabola. So since opens to the left, so this is now the formula to write the standard equation for this parabola. Then this time, we need to find now the three values the K, the P, and the H. Since H and K from the vertex of the parabola, so we need to find the coordinate. So the coordinate starts from X, that's positive 2, and Y, that's negative 5. So vertex is positive 2 and negative 5. So this is H and K. Then to find P, so P equals positive 4. So we can write now the standard equation using this formula. So we have Y minus K. K is negative 5. Then equals 4 times P. P is 4 times X minus H. 
H is positive 2, then to simplify, so this double negative, so this becomes positive, then negative 4 times 4, this is negative 16, then times x minus 2, so this is now the standard equation for this parabola. Then to write the general equation, so we need to expand the standard equation. And for the square of this binomial, using the SMS, so the square of the first term, the square of the first term, that's y squared, m4 multiplication, so multiply these numbers. 2 times positive 5, that's positive 10 times y, so positive 10y. Then the square of the last term, so the square of 5, that's positive 25, then equals, distribute this negative 16, so negative 16x, and negative 16 times negative 2, so negative times negative, that's positive 32. Then equate this to 0. So transpose to the other side. So this becomes positive 16. Transpose to the other side. So this becomes negative 32 equals 0. Then combine like terms and arrange this equation. So we have y squared. Then followed by x positive 16x. Then positive 10y, and this positive 25, negative 32. This is negative 7, then equals 0. So this is now the general equation for this parabola.